Number 1. Airmobile The evolution of the supercar is the Airmobile. Inspired by the mythical wing horse Pegasus, the Airmobile is the heightened vehicle species equally at home on the road or in the sky, the flying car. The culmination of leading-edge automotive and aerospace design and engineering, advanced materials, luxury features, and impeccable styling, the Airmobile does what no supercar or private jet can do. It can seamlessly transform from car to aircraft, from driving to flying, in under three minutes. Airmobile will bring to market the flying car that is both cool and sophisticated, and will set new standards of innovation, driver and passenger experience, and safety. The first Airmobiles will be the result of over 10 years of research and development by an outstanding team of engineers and designers. Its pedigree includes top automakers BMW, Aston Martin, McLaren, Mercedes-Benz F1 and Ferrari F1, and aerospace leaders Lockheed Martin, Rolls-Royce, Airbus, and Diamond Aircraft, among others. Test pilots report the Airmobile to be easy to fly and highly stable in flight. Flying a car can be far more exciting than riding one on the road. In addition to there being no speed limits or traffic jams in the air, there is a feeling of exhilaration that arises from breathtaking views and the inbound and freedom that being above it all brings. Number 2. Klein Vision Air Car The Klein Vision Air Car is a two-seat flying car designed by Stefan Klein and made in Slovakia. It was type certified as an aircraft in January 2022. The main views are large of the air car doubles as a two-seat road car with four large road wheels. Styled like a sports coupe, it contributes 30 to 40 percent of the total lift when in the air. For flight it is fitted with fold-out wings and extending tail booms carrying a high tail. A pusher propeller is permanently installed but when the fuselage and tail and a safety parachute is installed. Construction is primarily a semi-monocoque of carbon fiber composite over a steel subframe. When on the road, the retracted tail surface creates a downforce similar to conventional rear airfoils. Power is provided by a 1.6-liter BMW road car engine, running on automotive petrol or gasoline, and delivering 104 kilowatts. The prototype air car is of comparable length to Mercedes S-Class saloon at 5.2 meters and around 2 centimeters. Overall weight is 1,100 kilograms. Number 3. Terrafugia Transition The Terrafugia Transition is a rotable flying car with a capacity for two people, including one crew. A single Rotax 912 ULS piston engine powers the light sport vehicle. The engine is a hybrid design that can work with either the premium-grade automobile gasoline or the 100LL aviation fuel. This carbon fiber drivable aircraft was designed to fly at a maximum speed of 95 knots. The aircraft is equipped with an avionics panel on the dashboard and can also be flown on autopilot mode. The vehicle comprises folding wings and a twin tail and is designed to fit in a standard size garage. As of 2022, the company has an airworthiness certification to operate in the skies over the US, but it has yet to receive the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration NHTSA, approval for driving on highways. Experts believe the company will face challenges in performing extensive crash testing for roadworthiness. What are your thoughts on the Terrafugia Transition flying car and its future? Tell us in the comment section. Number 4. A POW V Liberty The POW V Liberty is a combination of a three-wheel car and an autogyro or gyroplane under development by POW V of the Netherlands. Both the driver's license and an autogyro pilot's license are required to operate the vehicle. Bow the Liberty can yak hotro boy mo king quato fia salki bang gan. Ing wo yu king kodi in hen shan chine oi juwa cheo otu bat al king quatri theo in hu kyo tai mo. No ko tam hold on 400 km ba ko the 80 taco lin toy 180 km per hour ki o cheo bay. The Pal V Liberty is currently powered by a traditional gasoline engine, the same used in many conventional cars. However, it could potentially be adapted to other types of fuels or even electric batteries in the future. The Pal V Liberty is currently undergoing the certification process with the ASA within the CS27 framework for small rotorcraft. Walter shared that he expected the aircraft to be ready for deliveries toward the end of 2024. If successful with its certification process, Pal V, which so far has been entirely funded by private investors and several family offices, is aiming to produce up to 1,200 aircraft annually within a period of five years. Number 5. Terrafugia DFX 
The Terrafugia DFX is an autonomous flying car under development by Boston-based Terrafugia. The TFX seats four passengers and uses an engine combined with two electric motors for propulsion. Unlike the previously proposed transition, the TFX is capable of vertical takeoff and landing by extending its retractable wings attached with pusher propellers, while aerial thrust is provided by a ducted fan at the rear. It will be able to fit in a single car garage. Powered by two plug-in hybrid 600 horsepower electric motors and a 300 horsepower fuel engine, the TFX is planned to have a flight range of 500 miles with a cruising flight speed of 200 miles per hour without the need to refuel or recharge. The DFX is expected to be capable of avoiding air traffic, bad weather, and restricted and tower-controlled airspace. For additional safety features, the TFX would automatically land at the nearest airport if the operator becomes unresponsive. Additionally, if a DFX operator declares an emergency, the authorities will be automatically notified of the situation, and the DFX can be landed in a non-approved landing zone. The TFX also features a backup full vehicle parachute system that can be activated if the operator believes the vehicle is incapable of auto landing.